my babies and I had my first kiss I've walked down Main Street in the cold morning mist Over there is where I bought my first car It turned over once but then it never went far And I can see the sun setting fast And just like they say nothing good ever lasts We'll go on now and kiss it goodbye But hold on to your love cause your heart's bound to die Hi, welcome to Our Town. I'm Jill Lawrence, and today we're here with the Norfolk Recreation Director, Anne Proto. Hi, Anne. Hi, thanks, Jill. <laughs> thanks so much for being here well, with us today. Well, thanks for having me. I appreciate it. Yeah, we're going to well, talk all things recreation. <laughs> great. Glad to talk about recreation. Yeah. So, um, the Recreation Department is responsible for all recreation programming and field allocation for the Town of Norfolk. Right. We do programming all year round. We, have three, we issue three catalogs a year and then we also uh, work with DPW but we do re we are responsible for the field allocation and uh, helping the sports organizations um, have the facilities that they need right right no that's yeah. important so you really have you know several big big jobs on mm -hmm. your plate and we're so glad you're taking time out of your busy day your busy week to be here um, so let's jump right into talking about programming because I think that I know that's of interest um, to a lot of people in town it seems that um, the town of Norfolk has a great reputation for a lot of great um, programs in the, in the, within the recreation department and a lot of yeah. new stuff and yeah. Well that's uh, always nice to hear. <laughs> um, our winter catalog just came out. Mm -hmm. uh, Hold that up. Yeah. As you see and registration just started last Wednesday and it's in full swing. Uh, we have programming for all age groups. We start at actually at, at babies and go okay. right through adult. Uh, our concentration is in, uh, we have pre a lot of preschool and, and school age programs. Right. We do have some uh, middle school age programs as well, including okay. the middle school video production right. done right here. Right, takes place right here at right NCTV. Here, right. <laughs> And then there is a session coming up that's in this catalog. So okay, great. So it, registration um, began uh, last last Wednesday. Last December Wednesday, 5th. and people can yeah. register online, which is the probably the most common way people now register. Mm -hmm. uh, but they're also able to come to our office and bring a check if they like. Okay. But if they want Drop to use by. a credit card, they just do it online. Okay, yep. so online or in person, and it's yep. in the in the town hall, right? Yep. Basement of the town hall. They can hall. mail them in as well. We're pretty easy. Um, we'll give this at the end of the show as well, but www.virtualnorfolk.org slash rec, R-E-C. Yes. Okay, yeah. so great. So do you want to tell us a little bit about the highlights of the winter catalog? This program? Uh, sure, I would be glad to. Um, well, I think um, we'll start with um, the preschool group. Uh, practicing preschool has been going on for several years. It's a very popular program. Uh, we do a, a shortened day for those that are almost three or three that haven't had a drop-off program experience. We have experienced preschool teachers teaching the program. Oh, great. And it's just enough time for kids to get used to mom not being there for an hour, an hour and a half. Right. And we even have a little bit of an extended day portion as well, if that okay. works better for a parent. Staying so. for lunch or something. Yeah, yeah. yeah. just okay. you know, a little bit longer, and okay. uh, that's very popular. Um, and for even the younger groups, we had a, a, a very long-lived program, which <laughs> continues to boom, is Sticky Fingers, right. which so many oh. parents have attended. And my kids still talk about it. They still right. want to go, even though right. they're it's, too old right. by five I, or six years. I tell parents it's where we let everything uh, happen that you don't want to have happen uh, in your living room, like glitter. Yeah, so right. uh, for all Shaving of those, cream, right. like just, yeah, sticky, right. it's like literally sticky fingers. Right. Yeah. So right. for those kids who like to get into goo, it's perfect. And we okay. also have music classes for the very young, yeah. so yeah. Um, which That's is great. just wonderful. It's just, yeah. It's With a, great teachers, yeah. I, well, I mean, thank no, personally. You. Yeah. I have to say I take great pride in our teachers, I'm, and I, I love our teachers. We, um, we're very selective, and those that teach for us are just terrific. Yeah. Um, yeah. We have a new program, the Tiny Dancers, uh, which started this fall. Uh, we did a little bit last year, but and, the, and this um, coming January, uh, we're going to, it's ballet, but we're going to add a little hip-hop in there oh, for those. Okay. Very 
yeah. stylish, <laughs> the stylish kids that want to. The, hot, the hip yeah, kids. Yeah, the hip kids. So tiny dancers is what about what age? What's it's age, uh, age three to five. Oh, so it yeah. is tiny. Yeah, it's yeah. they're tiny. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Okay. And then we go right into the school age programs. Right. And the school age programs are very are, are varied. Yeah. We do everything from science after school. We have a new program called Inspirational Art. Okay. For K that through two, yeah. Yeah. Um, huh. we have Never drama <laughs> uh, at um, both schools and PZ, as um, okay. many people know, have been right. has been doing theater um, theater after school and during the summer for the uh, and she starts a, at a younger grade during the summer, but uh, grades three through six at the at the Freeman, Freeman. Kennedy School. Okay. And yep. she's a teacher at Freeman. Yep. and PZ has been well. a, yeah. been a teacher there for a long time and right. has been doing drama. Okay. for yeah. more years than I can remember, but right. that probably says something more about my age <laughs> than anything else. Um, um, okay, so, so art, you mentioned art science, and there's a new one about uh, exotic animals that I've yes. my art. Yeah, yeah it's, it's actually eye. been, um, it's uh, very popular. We, we uh, have animal adventures in, they're in Bolton, Mass. Oh, okay. They uh, rescue exotic animals. Mm. And uh, we had our first session uh, starting just four weeks ago, actually tomorrow was the last day of the oh, four great. of the first session, and we have met everything from we had a snapping, uh, let's see what was it called, an, um, an alligator snapping turtle. Oh, I, did, I had to think oh, about okay. that so because we also had an alligator, oh, an actual that, alligator, an alligator, <laughs> and we had uh, last week we had an owl, an um, uh, eagle owl, and I think that was from Asia. We've had oh. many types of lizards. Oh, okay. We had a legless lizard. We had all types of snakes. Oh, wow. We had a python. Wow. Uh, and I think the highlight was when they did Australia, though. Yeah. And a kangaroo surprised us all. They brought a kangaroo. Brought a kangaroo oh, and the kangaroo took a tour of the cafeteria. <laughs> and uh, I, I have to say, oh. I had never patted a kangaroo yeah. and I was yeah. very happy I was stuck, yeah, I, I stuck around and I did that yeah. um, he and the kangaroo was on our we have do we do, we do have a Facebook page and okay. I do oh, post right. um, pictures oh, from right. things so I, I did that post out. that I was I'm not sure if the Python is up I was gonna post that as well but okay. I'll get it up there yeah so your yeah. Facebook page is um, what would you search under just Norfolk Recreation, Norfolk Recreation Massachusetts. right yeah. Massachusetts you might get you might get yeah. Virginia yeah um, we do get okay. calls from Virginia once in a while especially okay. about our basketball program oh that's good because <laughs> um, yeah, that's a perfect segue when yeah. you're ready because mm -hmm. it is a great program but no back to the catalog so yeah, I've heard about this new animal one, and there's another. There's a another session. Yes, like for starting January. in January, right. it's another four week session. Okay, uh, K with, through six. Uh, no, what's the age? It is K oh. through six. Okay. It, now it is held at the Freeman Kennedy School, mm -hmm. so we start a little later. We start at okay. three thirty, so uh, parents are able to get the younger kids to the okay. school, right. so we can start at three thirty, okay. and that time 315 to 330 we do supervise the kids oh, okay. um, so right. that way we they, and they get a full hour of, yeah. of, oh, of animals awesome. yeah. it was re it's really um, amazing and they uh, the person that owns animal adventures we've had a couple of people but he he's a zoologist he's okay. very knowledgeable so it's not just seeing the animals that's right. about it's learning about learning the about them yep, learning care. about the animals and okay. about um, they're all different things habitat what you know yeah. Their um, weak, you know what what their predators are, right. how they defend themselves in the if wild. If they're endangered, right. I'm sure. Yeah. Like nice, yeah, that's yeah. great to get that things. get that out. Yeah. Um, so, and then going up, I know you do. Uh, besides, like a lot of the, the arts and, and, and the science you mentioned, but there's also a lot of school age sports. Well, so, I actually I sports. actually saved that oh. for, the, okay. for the end because there is a lot of school age yeah. sports, and we have uh, there's a we use a group called Fast Athletics okay. for the after That's school right. sports. There, um, uh, coaches that come in, they have and they're they're great guys. They do a yeah. wonderful job. So, okay. um, for all those kids who want to yeah. run off some extra <laughs> energy at the oh, end yeah. of the end of the day, or all those moms who want their kids right. to run off the extra energy <laughs> before they um, head home, but they also um, you know learn learn we um, sports, but all and all our sports programs always, especially for the younger ages, emphasize sportsmanship and teamwork right. mm -hmm. and all those everyone good things. Gets, it's not about winning the game. Time, right? It's okay. uh, it's about you know 
playing with others and right. oh, good. getting the best out of everything. Yeah, and it's so nice that so many of your school age programs do take place at one of the elementary schools. I mean, not everyone, yes. but HOD or Freeman, so it's right. convenient, I think, for parents. Right. Um, you have from, and I, you know, I, I've been taking, we've been taking classes or doing programming for a long time in our family, but I know you have um, just for after school, you've got, you know, dodgeball and, right? Um, mm -hmm. I mean, there's all sorts of, there's, right. there's been gymnastics in the past. There's, is there car uh, karate? There's karate all karate. the time. Design defense yeah. is, um, there's all sorts has, of it comes every Monday and uh, Wednesday. And they've been doing this for years. I think, see, I've been there 13 years, and I think uh -huh. they've actually been there longer than oh, that. Wow. But they, uh, they do do a karate program, and it's very reasonably priced. Okay. Uh, it's, uh, I think it's, um, Sixty dollars a month, including the ghee, and then it goes to two fifty. Day, two days. Right, and it's two yeah. days. It's very, very reasonable. Okay. Uh, and they do. They've been doing it with us for a long time. They do a great job, and a lot of people, you know, start and they stick with it right, right. through. That's great. Yeah. And is karate also K through K through six? Yes. Right? Okay. Yep. K great. through six. Okay. Anything else in the in the winter catalog? Um, that well, there's a there is a wide variety. We also have. Um, some engineering with Legos, which oh, is very right. popular. We yeah. run that in the summer as well. Okay. And it, they do use Legos, but it's the, also the engineering portion of cool. it. And just this year, we started a, a robotics class. We've had the first. We've just fin we're just finishing up Introduction to Robotics. Oh, wow. So Robotics 1 will start uh, a, it, this in the winter okay. session. Okay. And that's a little bit more advanced. It's actually for age, in, ages 10 and up. Okay. Uh, uh, but it's uh, taught by an engineer, and oh, they really neat. they really do learn a lot about the robotics, and they right. end up having a robot that's theirs. Oh, cool! So it is oh, cool. Oh wow! Yeah. All so right. and he, he's local, and his family's from Norfolk. Oh, good. So. Um, oh wow! So I didn't know that Carol must be Payton. that's a fairly new th program. Yeah, huh? it is yeah. new, and uh, we've done some different robotics in the past, but okay. this is a. Uh, um, it seems to be working out really well, and so, and it's really very hands on. The kids and leaving with a robot and. Uh, really learning how the how they work how they work and how they could work or um, is important and a little bit different. And Carl came to uh, our summer playground program last oh, summer and okay. did a dry ice. Um, oh, I heard. It, actually, yeah. it was liquid nitrogen. Liquid nitrogen, right? right. right. Which right. is dry yeah. ice. I think. So, but it, I mean, it was more of a the science part of it. So yeah. I should um, oh, demonstration really? and he. Um, okay. Kids had a, a kid, it. yeah, it was great. Yeah. It was wonderful. Yeah, science is just, yeah, I don't know. I right. think science is fascinating. So, yeah, you mentioned right off, right out of the gate that Norfolk Recreation is programming all year round. Right. We're sort of focused on the winter catalog because right. of the time of year, but well, the, and, the and fall, it goes right through the summer. And mm -hmm. yeah. The fall and the winter have some similar sports programs. You okay. had mentioned the dodgeball. We have right. super sports for the younger right. grade. We have um, Friday night volleyball, which is Great for oh. it's girls volleyball. It's Friday night volleyball, and it's uh, four through six, and then also six through eight. So we do have some middle school programming okay. as well. Oh yeah, so we'll move right up. We sort of started with the youngest, mm -hmm. and so y your school age, uh, a lot of it goes until grade six, but you also have middle school programming. Yeah, and not then, quite as much. We do much, have a yeah. Friday night dodgeball for four weeks. Oh, okay, starting for in, middle school for kids. middle school oh, at the middle school. Oh, okay, we have the volleyball. But we also, in grades three through six, I should also mention that we're very excited to be a partner with a school. We are a school partner, and okay. this um, January, uh, January, February time frame, we have a math games, we have a homework club, we have study skills, uh -huh. and we're also offering a Spanish and a oh. stock market program. Oh, wow. So, yeah. and the stock market program is for the fifth and sixth grades, a little older, for okay. those that want right. to, that makes you know, sense. Yeah. learn, you know, just learn about... Um, even if they don't know anything about the stock market, just another aspect, you know, those that are interested in business or right. math or... Yeah. And yeah, they are and how it works. Yeah. 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 And they actually get a... It's a mock game, but it's okay. a... It, and it's not just in our school. It's a program. Uh, and oh. uh, it's called the like Stock Market national Game National <laughs> Program. And they okay. have a $100,000, not real, but yeah. in imaginary, <laughs> that they try to build. Oh, cool. So oh, it is wow. cool. Yeah. yeah. All right, great. So that's a little bit old, mm -hmm. kids, so a little yeah. older. Yeah. Um, you mentioned the middle school, the middle school programming, and then as far as in going to adults, because there's a whole section of the catalog. We do every have time a lot for, for adult adults. Yeah. yeah, I should probably mention the Norfolk Youth Basketball is now oh, Norfolk yeah. Rentham Youth okay, Basketball, that's right. and that's K through eight this year. That's okay. new. We've expanded that through the eighth, and that just started. 
Okay. We actually just went to the Celtics game this oh, past right. weekend. Yeah. It was very exciting that we had a 28 kids on the court doing high five with oh, the Celtics player. That That's an so option cool. if you buy Celtics tickets. Right. So um, we only have so many spots, so we oh, okay. um, randomly you draw. Draw it. Okay, right. lottery. Um, and this year it actually worked out that the kids that were involved, uh, that went with families, we had we had enough spots on the court, so they all went down. And the King Philip girls played at halftime. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, so it was just happened yeah. to be. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, it King was Philip all arranged. In, in high school. Well, it was arranged. Um, uh -huh. Norfolk Rentham Youth Basketball, oh, okay. the coaching is headed up, as you oh, know, by right. Sean sure. McGinnis. And yeah. uh, uh, we have the varsity coaches and okay. the... Um, and other coaches as well, and the KP players helping out on the court. Right. But and that does go through eight. Eight K through eight. Right. Boys and girls. Yes, boys and including girls. Including towns of Norfolk and Rentham. Yes, we, and or, you know, I'm glad you brought that up though, yeah. because we we don't ex our programs, although by far the majority are Norfolk kids, um, because we are part of a tri town right. uh, community in the King Philip community. We always, uh, you know. Those open it people, up, yes, or, we yeah. always open it up, okay. and this is Norfolk Rentham Youth Basketball, yes, of course, right. but it's we also combined. take people from other towns as well. Okay, great, yeah. and that's a Saturday. That's a Saturday recreation basketball, yes. right? Yeah. And um, is it? I guess for this season, do you take people at this time, or would it be? Well, finished? actually, we had two more people register this week. But, okay, so, so but it's really we're, it's it's, kind of, we're now at four hundred and yeah. oh, twenty or wow. twenty five. So that's we a lot of kids. So we. So it might be. I mean, right. but if someone called and wanted to wanted to play, we okay. we never say no. Okay. We want kids to play. <laughs> right. Call call yeah. as soon as possible. Yeah. And I, from what I understand, that program is about. You know, it used to be just Norfolk Youth Basketball, but it's about what six years old? Does that sound right? It started in two thousand and six. Yes. Oh, okay, yeah. six years, yeah. so and it's, it's just years. grown. I mean, you're it up has, to wow. Yeah. It started yes. small, and you've really yeah, it was about a hundred the first year, I think, okay. or maybe a little bit more. Okay. Um, but it's really taken off, and it's been yeah. it's great. Okay. Well, great. So that's another. That's sort of almost like a, a, a separate entity because mm -hmm. it is. It's the whole winter season for yes. basketball, and the games are at the KP Middle School and, and the high school. Oh, actually. and both. Now, okay. Now because it's now, so big, right? Now we're at the high school as oh, well. Okay. So. Wow. That's great. And Thursday nights we have practice at the middle school. Okay. Yeah. Oh, great. And then, do you want to talk about the adult classes a little bit? Sure. Just, I'd, um, I'd love to. I know we we talk a lot about we kids. Have some great adult programming. Um, Bob Shepard does a digital uh, camera class about yeah. you know using using your camera and getting the best out of it. And then in, in addition to that, following that, he does a uh, how to make your own. Um, I, I want to say photo book, but I, I really okay. don't describe this nearly as well as I should. This is a it's like a coffee table book. It's oh, a, wow. a, it looks like of it is of your own a, photos of your own photos. Cool. His examples are breathtakingly beautiful. Wow. And I, when I first saw one, I was like, oh my gosh, I just can't believe this is the type of book you can make with your own photos. Wow. And they're wonderful to make as for presents, for weddings, and right. new births, but they're also just to have memories. Yeah. And, you know, wow. he's very, he's like, oh, they're easy to do. We get, you know, get everyone involved. And hmm. Oh, um, wow. So, so that's so yeah. the, the camera, digital yeah. camera, and the, cl and the yeah. book. Wow. And we have that's Nancy okay. Kaling, who does exercise right. classes. And yeah, has she's got her own them. page now, she I has, noticed. She's had her own page for a while. Um, <laughs> and she's an, a fitness instructor. Yes, who and she's does. certified in everything imaginable. Yeah. Um, uh, she uh, does um, a, a Pilates-based class. She yeah. does strength training. Yeah. She does... Um, uh, a happy dog's hike. Oh, that's so you, right. So you can I take your dog, your dog with you, or you can just do. The, in the winter, she does a snowshoe. Oh, wow. Trekking class. Okay. Um, that is based on the amount of snow we have, though. It might just right. be a hiking class, but she does okay. that. You know, it looks just, like for women. Right. Yeah. Yeah, it's for women, but they but, um, people go out. Um, so if it's even if it's snowing, yeah, people bring their snowshoes oh, and go that's out. Great. Yeah. And is a, right, so she does a lot Pilates as well as strength training, body sculpting, mm -hmm. and her, a lot of her indoor classes are right at the town hall. Right, They're the right in the town room. hall. Yeah. yeah, a lot of we have several locations. The schools, of course, oh, right. are wonderful to us. We have use the schools yeah. for a lot of programs, including Zumba at night oh, for adults. Okay. Oh yeah, and, that's uh, popular. Right, <laughs> and also um, futsal for adults and and men's basketball for adults. Okay. Uh, but we also have a multi-purpose room next to our office, and okay. we do a lot of children's programming there. But Nancy does use that room for exercise classes. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Great. So I think yeah, and in the mm -hmm. yoga as well. And, and, right. We have two we two different types of yoga. We have a 
um, uh, we have on different days, so okay. we have two different types two yogas. of yogas. Yeah. And before we kind of, you know, wrap the talking about the programming, there's um, there's horseback riding that I know that I, we've participated in. There's also the skiing and snowboarding classes that you do through with a partner right. and Blue swimming. Hills. Yeah. And then and then there's also another category which is the uh, I know that you work with the Adirondack Club with f some food classes. So do you want to, do you want to, uh, sure. any details you yeah. want to add to that? So <laughs> um, uh, we actually work with John Croati who has, uh, owns, uh, who is the owner of the grill at the Adirondack Club. Okay, so we have right. the location of our cooking classes is the Adirondack Club. Oh, and he offers good. two or three each um, session. And we have party foods and we have simple and awesome meals okay. coming that up. They're, they're actually early on. I don't remember okay. the dates quite offhand, but they're early. Ones. January, February. Yeah. yeah, January, February. And then he also does, uh, just once a year, he does a cook, kids cooking program. And that's oh. three weeks. I think it's, okay. um, it, that's three weeks and it's for a couple of hours. Okay. Um, the afternoons and the kids do ha have a blast. Yeah. Um, they make they learn how to make the best macaroni and cheese ever. Oh, wow. But re all real <laughs> ingredients. Um, nothing it. you know. Everyone everyone knows what they're eating. Yeah. <laughs> it's not that special color orange. Right. Oh my gosh. Um, and uh, we also have um, a cupcake class happening oh. at the Adirondack Club as well for kids. For kids. Oh, yeah. Okay. It's fun with cupcakes and fondant. So they okay. we'll that's be doing that. And that's also I think in January. I think okay. that's. Oh, kids cooking. The 16th. Yeah. Maybe the 16th. Yeah. yeah, that looks right. Yeah, yeah. fun with cupcakes and yeah. fondant. Oh, that's yeah. that's great. Yeah. So we partner with John, and we partner with other uh, companies and organizations as well. Uh, um, the YMCA has been doing. We have a gymnastics program. Okay. Uh, for little children in the, on Tuesday mornings, and they've been doing that for a long time. But we are also able to offer swim lessons right. through the Franklin Y. Okay. And it works out really well because they. Um, they give us a, a discounted price, okay. so if you're not a member of the Y, uh, you don't need to. You, you can still save some money, and you can register through Norfolk Recreation, okay. and that's really for all ages. A lot of people think about it for preschool and pre-K ages, but they have swim lessons for all ages. Okay, that's and great. even the <coughs> Aqua no. programs for adults, oh, they can okay. register through us. They would need to. We don't print them all, okay. only because there's so many. Okay, so and they we, all take place at the um, Franklin, the Franklin Hockamock Hockamock Y. Yes, at the Franklin Y. Okay, and the um, you had mentioned the snowboarding. And there's class. also skiing and yeah. snowboarding. Yeah. We do that every year, uh, and they. Um, I think only one year did we actually really run into some difficult weather that we just didn't have enough snow, but it doesn't happen that often. We've also had some wonderful years with lots of snow, yeah. uh, but it's Fridays after school and there is okay. enough time uh, to get from school. We don't yeah. provide transportation, okay. um, only because a lot of times it's easier for parents to have the car packed up and they pick their <laughs> yeah. kids up and head over to Blue Hills. It's really not okay. that far yeah. and uh, okay. kids have a great time. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. I mean, those are all. It's you have, and that's actually a great um, way to kind of talk a little bit more about your partnerships because you do have so many community partnerships. You mentioned the Adirondack mm -hmm. Club, the Franklin Y, Blue Hills skiing um, and boarding, and yeah. uh, and then. So, uh, do you want to talk a little bit about um, current partners and people that uh, you know organizations that you work with? Sure. Um, we also work with Four Kicks. They we have oh, a so okay. for example in the springtime. Uh, which isn't in this brochure, but it'll be in the, in the spring brochure, and also it's in the fall brochure. We'd have a middle school golf league. Oh, okay. um, they run a golf league, and they can, you can sign up through Norfolk Recreation. Um, there's an indoor uh, futsal program okay. through, through Four Kicks, four kicks. so you can okay. sign up through Norfolk Recreation. Uh, so we offer a variety of their programs, oh, okay. uh, Four so. Kicks through uh, through us, and um, so between the Y and um, the Adirondack Club offering yeah. programs and Four Kicks offering programs. Right. October um, Farm. October Farm. Another Farms, one to mention because yeah. they do a horseback Friday, right. which we've done before. Right. Um, I think we covered a lot of, a lot yeah. of the programming. Yeah. Um, so I know that the Norfolk Lions and the NCL, the Norfolk Community League, also partner sometimes with Norfolk Recreation. Right. They're, they're wonderful supporters. We do do... Um, uh, so... Um, I'm not sure how people even think about how, you know how we fund all our, our programs, but our, we are self-supporting. So we offer a lot of obviously a, a lot of okay, most yeah. by far of our right. programs are for a fee, okay. but not everything that we do is for a fee. Okay. Um, Norfolk Recreation does the 
lights on Town Hill for the, oh, now this time oh, of year. Okay. We do the you fund the, all the lights. Yeah, we oh. fund all the lights. We fund all the um, the the free concert series. We oh, fund that's that. Right. That's a summer. Um, that's outdoor a summer, concerts, right? Yeah. We also do all the refreshments. I'm skipping around here a little yeah. bit. The refreshments. <laughs> that's okay. Um, at the Santa Parade, but the right. Norfolk Lions does the parade and the right. pictures, and they just do yes, a, they do a wonderful job. job. It's a, yeah. it's always fun. Yeah, um, it is. It is. So and they've been on. Santa was here. Yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, so uh, we do that. We do the um, and the other lar the program that although people do pay a fee, it's our summer playground program, oh, which is um, for those entering grades two through six, and it's a dollar a day. Yeah. So, um, and they, people do have, are required to pay a registration fee. We get right. a, you know, we have to uh, make sure we know who's at the program. Right. Um, it's but a small it is, registration fee, though. It's right. uh, $12 right. um, if it's before a certain right. date. Early registration. Yeah, early yeah. registration. Okay. And then it goes up to 20 but that actually includes a t-shirt that kids I get know. to tie-dye. And it's a dollar a day for four hours, Four right? hours, Three, right. <laughs> that's amazing. Yes. So, uh, um, that those fees don't fund that program, right, it, um, right. but they, they fund a portion of it, but they don't okay. fund the whole thing. So we need to raise a, about another $12,000 during the course of the year. We do that okay. through grants and, uh, and the Lions and NCL, um, okay. we, they, have, uh, they have provided grants for they us allocate. for okay. year, okay. for many years. We ask for you know, help with our supplies and such. We've also received grants from Walmart. Okay. Um, yeah, and we continue to look for grants. We're always looking right. for grants. So if anyone, if you know of anyone, any company that just wants to be yeah. generous with their money, right. we're happy to happy to okay. take it. Okay. Yeah, happy to, to have a conversation. Right. Okay. So Walmart. It says any any other in town. Anyone that? Um, well, we have um, we have you know there are a lot of smaller local businesses okay. that support that, that support, support us yeah. and they support us in different ways. We have different ways to be supported. Right. We have the banners at the fields and okay. going back to the playground program, we actually offer oh, yeah. a sponsor for a day. Okay. And it's a hundred dollars, and we've had many. I and I will. I I have to mention Foxborough Federal and Dunkin' Donuts. They've supported us for years and years, okay. um, and in both in both ways. Um, oh, okay. So, and I know Dunkin' Donuts has teamed up with the Lions to also support us. So oh, I mean, it's, we're all yeah. we're all kind of working together. But they've oh, God. that's been a sense right, of community. Right, they've been <laughs> right there for though. us. It's, um, Okay. Been wonderful, and we've had you know several other partners, even in an Acorn Animal Hospital. Okay. Um, I think uh, they uh, they did a sponsorship for a day. We had um, the Eagle Brook. The someone? Eagle Brook has just you know Chuck Horn's been a great yeah. supporter. I think yeah. he's a wonderful supporter of King Philip uh, Athletics, and he's also been a wonderful supporter for us to help bring us the youth basketball program, but also to support our fields okay. and the banners and. Uh, the, I, I wish I had a list in front of me, yeah, so no, I, that's okay. I wouldn't um, forget. No, but, you know, I'm just thinking now. It's like Barry Zimmerman's been a supporter for uh, so long, and yeah. Norfolk Baseball's a supporter. And, oh, great! Yeah, you like, have to work with Norfolk Baseball quite right? a bit, right? But they yeah. do a they do a banner every year, and um, we have um, just. It'll, it'll all come to me in about yeah, okay. two minutes. So. Well, we have we just have about a minute left, so uh, I, I think we covered we covered a lot of programming and a lot of examples, which I think is helpful because people, you know, it might help them delve further into the into mm -hmm. the catalog, mm -hmm. into the brochure uh, for winter, and then you'll of course every spring there's a spring summer catalog that comes yes, out usually around April. Uh, actually, okay. before that, oh, March. yeah, okay. yeah, registrations start in March, and I would always say please register early it really makes a huge difference in our planning okay. um, and it's also great for the teachers to know what they can plan it's not just planning our supplies so it's okay. teachers planning the program That's and true. Uh, which you know it's it's we are much more comfortable if we know right. a little bit ahead of time how many we expect and yeah. make sure we're prepared and prepared well. Okay. Well, you do so, a great job. So I'm so glad that, that you came in today and we were able to talk about a lot of the, you know, all all the facets of the Norfolk Recreation Department. And I know we'll probably have, hopefully have you back too to talk about further future projects and, you I'd know, maybe we, sometime. We just had a, a, some... Uh, money given to us at town meeting for the field, so I'd love to talk about that. Okay, and so we'll do that another and in the future, another future show. Well, thanks again, Anne, for being here, and and please go to the website, um, which we'll put up on for you if you have any more information about Norfolk Recreation and Proto. Thank you Thank very you. much. Thanks for having me sure. again. Yeah, it was great. And from for our town, thanks for watching. I we'll see you soon. See the sun setting fast, and just like they say.
nothing could ever last We'll go on now and kiss it goodbye But hold on to your love Cause your heart's bound to die 